Hello, my name is Marlon, and today I'm going to talk about my experience with uh, the medication that Abilify and Wellbutrin. So, here we go. Okay, so I'm going to start with um, a little bit of why I am on this medication. So, I have been dealing with anxiety, depression, and bipolar disorder for a long time already, but I wasn't quite aware of how it was affecting me until um, a couple months ago when I um, did a little bit of, you know, research and a lot of soul searching and came to the conclusion that I needed to seek help. Um, two months ago, I had a really bad me meltdown and, and I almost committed suicide. That's something no many people know about. I haven't told many people, only my close friends. So that night, I decided that I was going to seek help. Um, so I I know some people prefer to to do um, therapy, you know, talk to someone and fix it that way. But um, I wanted to take the fast way because I wasn't in, in, in a place where I could wait for too long for for a change so um, I was put on Abilify and Wellbutrin which uh, I have right here both of them um, so I'm, I'm gonna tell you a little bit of how it's going for me um, first one I have Abilify um, I am taking five milligrams which is one of the lowest uh, dosages that you can get dosage that you can get um, I think the highest you can get is like 40 milligrams but this one is fine when you're trying to deal with a uh, um, bipolar disorder and I, I have read that it's more effective when you are taking a little a little dosage in uh, and when you're taking a higher dosage sometimes it takes a lot of um, you know side effects or it doesn't just it, it just doesn't work on you um, so yeah um, it's been helping me a lot with my anxiety, my depression, and everything. Um, if I remember before the medication, I would have uh, mental breakdowns every day, every moment of the day. And it was very impossible. It was becoming impossible for me to go to work, for me to do anything. So this one, I recommend if you're going to take it, take it during night I, i'm not an expert but uh this is from my uh, personal experience if you're gonna take it you can i would ad advise you take it at night because i feel it made me really tired um so if you're you you have to get a lot of sleep when you are on this medication um so it's not gonna take side effects because i remember at the beginning it made me a little bit of it gave me dizziness and all that stuff but as as you go um it's gonna lessen um the effects so don't worry about it it's just normal that yeah just your eyes are gonna be blurry for like the first or the first or the second week so so yeah um this one it's not too bad i have read a lot i have read and watched videos of people that have had a lot of um, bad reactions to it but I haven't had any bad reactions so far so yeah it's been good so it's fine <laughs> um, the next one is uh, Wellbutrin this one it's it's uh, 150 milligrams so again it's one of the lowest dosages that you can get um, it, this one is a house also being good this one I don't feel it's made me so it, it hasn't given me like side effects or are too high hard to bear or to withstand um i think it's very uh manageable for your body and all that so i guess really in in in, in to shorten it down i think it, it's fine just don't be afraid to take the the fast the fast route as some people say it's fine if you're if you if you go this way because um therapy can help you a lot but 
it's gonna be a slow process and if you need something that's gonna be quick you can you can start medication and it's fine you don't have to feel ashamed if you do because it's fine um so yeah um also i recommend if you are going to take these medications you cannot drink alcohol and you cannot as with any other medication of course and you cannot uh drink coffee i know i was a coffee addict but since i started this medication i quit coffee and it's so much better for me now i can get at least seven to six hours of sleep when before i wasn't sleeping at all i was like awake at 3 a.m and i wasn't sleeping at all and i of course, it affects you, your body and, and your personal life to a really high level. So that's, um, I recommend as well, taking a lot of uh, drinking, sorry, a lot of tea. I've drank a lot of chamomile tea, mint tea, because it, it helps you uh, calm down. And it's going to give you like a, some kind of sedative effect. And... It's going to calm your nerves and make your body and mind relax. So, yeah, I recommend that. It's a short uh, review, but I hope, it, I hope it was a little bit helpful for you. And so, yeah, I was afraid of putting this out. But um, I think so many people would also need it, as I did need it in, in, in a couple months ago. So I hope you like this video and hope you stay safe and keep pushing on and you you can do it. You can do it. You've got it. You've got it. <laughs> okay. So love you. Take care. <laughs>